Hey, what's going on, guys? Well, looks like I'm going to go out on a solo mission this morning. Uh, Joey's got some personal things to take care of. So I'm going to hit up a spot that's a little closer to my home. See how it does this morning. I've had limited success in this spot before. Uh, I've got some redfish over here, but that's about it. Nothing, nothing large. Pretty small redfish at that. So we'll see if maybe I can do a little bit better this morning and hopefully catch some fish for y'all. Either that or, uh, well, at least have some bloopers. Fish on right there, guys. Fish on right there. How it's done, son. It's not a huge trout, but you know what? I'll take it this morning. I will definitely take it. There we go, guys. I didn't get skunked this morning. Already fishing the boat. Already a fish in the boat. There we go. A little dink trout, but it's a trout. Let's go show. These trout are still back up <clears throat> in these flats. We're on a completely different side of the bay. <clears throat> and they're still out here. Oh yeah, right there guys, right there. That's how we do it, son. I knew there's fish up in here. I knew there's fish. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Dude, he hammered that one. Yeah, buddy. Oh, 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 oh. Don't go anywhere, dude. Don't go anywhere. Here we go. There we go. Caught him down low. Here we go, guys. That's how it's done. Just for fun. Oh, yeah. 16 inches. I didn't want that topwater hit this morning. I mean, I had one little one on that topwater. But... Came out to this trout slick out here it's the only slick like it there's a nice little round slick and uh it's like all right it's like, let me get out here on this slick and try it out and sure enough trout are out here 
washed out are here. All right there. Yep. Doesn't feel like he's a huge one. That's okay. Uh, I'll catch some dink trout. inch dink. It's alright guys. Even the, even the small ones need loving too. Shot. Another dink. That's all right. He's not skiing though, so at least he's not that small. When you start skiing across the top of the water, you know they're tiny. Hey, quit it. Shot snippers at it again. Little male, he's croaking. Fish aren't as big right now. You know what? It's still a lot of fun. Get you a kayak, rod and reel, and get out in the water. Oh, I missed that one. on again. Yep. There we go. This one might be a little bit better. Yeah, you get the top one this time. A little bit bigger fish than the last couple. Thank you, sir. Way he goes. That lure has been slammed. I'm going to time to change it out. There we go. Push on right there. He's skiing, so he's pretty small. <laughs> oh, yeah, buddy. Catch of the day. <laughs> like I said, when they start skiing, you know you got a little one. <laughs> oh, it's still fun, though. Still having a blast. Too bad Joey's having to take care of his personal stuff today. He could be out here too. Here we go. Might be a little bit better fish. 
Definitely not skiing. Yeah, a little bit better. It wasn't the tiniest dink in the world. Away he goes. Ah, that was smooth. Smooth operator. Well guys, apparently my camera turned off on me for some reason. I, uh, I had some awesome trout. This makes me sick that my camera was, wasn't running. Literally, I had three trout that were 19 and 20. I was getting it all on camera. Apparently I wasn't. Had a nice little 15 inch redfish. Crap. That sucks. That's why you need more than one camera running. Literally that's my second bait I've already gone through. This is my third one. guys hey well it was one of those days on the water I had a lot of fun but things didn't go quite as planned you just never know whenever you go out thought I had my camera on I got into the fish had some nice 20 inch 19 inch trout didn't need a single one of them on video I did take a, a selfie and sent it to Joey because he wasn't out there with me today, so I was trying to brag for that. Had a nice little 15 inch redfish. So, video won't be as good as I like it to be, but it's still a video. Still shows me, catch, does catch, you know, show me catch some fish. So, like, subscribe, share, tell all your friends, follow us on Facebook, follow us on YouTube. All right, Yakers, what's going on? I just wanted to show you where Tyler was fishing. So if you come down here on 35, hit Market Street or exit Market Street 1069. You'll come down here 1069, and you'll come down Port Bay Road here. Okay, come all the way down. You have Port Bay Hunting and Fishing Club and obviously the kayak launch. So Tyler was fishing... A lot of these, if you can barely see them, but a lot of these little pilings here. This is where he was catching most of his trout at. Then he paddled across all the way to this island here. This is where he caught his redfish and some of those good sized trout that he was talking about. That he was not able to get on the cam. Unfortunately, I think that would have been a good video, but you know, camera issues happen. Anyways, we are going to be prospecting out this area a lot. Uh, we are going to try to come down here to the right-hand side and fish all this marshland here. Um, hopefully stick tuned for those videos and we'll get them out and uh, see what we can catch out there. Also, another way over here is to come down 188, so 35 to 188. You'll come all the way down take that first right-hand turn. And there is a kayak launch right here. So you'll launch right there so you can actually get to that island. It's a little bit easier to get to, not as far as a paddle maybe. 
even though it's almost the same distance to get to this island. But the option you'll have is to hit up Swan Lake uh, right here. And I've heard there's really good fish in this area. And we will be prospecting that also. So stay tuned for those videos. Hopefully you enjoyed this one. And remember, it's always about friends and family.